Indian Catholic Church has given a lot of its resources for the development of higher education in India. The same is true for the Kerala Catholic Church also. Uh, it is the Catholic Church who has given uh, such a great uh, impetus to the spread of higher education in the state of Kerala. If it were not for the church and its contribution, education level of Kerala would have been very low. So we have to acknowledge the deep and uh, unbelievable contribution that the Ch Catholic Church and the Christian community in Kerala have given to the spread and the growth of higher education. When we think of the contributions of the church in the past, we have to also mention the colleges and the institutions of higher education were the only means and channels for all the people who belong to different castes and races to have education, especially higher education in Kerala. Many a time our own people forget the sacrifices and the mobilization of resources given by the church in Kerala. Therefore, they often uh, make a complaint against the church saying that church is putting too much of importance to higher education. But if it were not for the church, Kerala would not have reached this state of uh, uh, intensity and greatness in the field of higher education. What we forget is the sacrifices and the resources put by the generations who went before us. And uh, sometimes there is a tendency for the people to exaggerate some of the defects and uh, wrongdoings on the part of those who run education institutions. When they exaggerate the, those wrongdoings or uh, corrupt, uh, ways of corruption that exist in some people, they forget that through the last so many decades, the church has given uh, enormous uh, uh, sacrificial contributions to the development of higher education. And uh, this fact, the great uh, fact of great sacrifice given by the church has to be acknowledged publicly by all the people who are engaged in the field of higher education. What we are doing is now uh, reaping the benefits of the sacrifices uh, given by the people who have gone before us. They, through their limited resources, they built up educational institutions. They uh, tried to uh, give a great ambience of, uh, of Christian culture, of uh, love and forgiveness to those who uh, pursued their higher education in the institutions of the church. Therefore, today as we uh, reflect about the status of higher education in Kerala, we have to acknowledge and uh, remember with gratitude the services done by the church in the field of higher education.